All right, back on uh, the morning brew. Uh, I, I love featuring the, the folks from Meals on Wheels because I think it's a really vital organization in our community. You, you have no idea what uh, a benefit this is to a lot of people, Meals on Wheels. Now, the numbers are this, serving about 500 clients a day, over 100,000 meals per year, and not only that, they have a great team of volunteers that deliver this food to people who uh, actually count on it. And uh, I love the organization. And uh, we have Shauna Kessler here, who is the executive director of Meals on Wheels of Albuquerque, and Amanda Vargas, who is uh, the uh, chef for Meals on Wheels. And welcome to both of you. Thank you. Thank Good you for having us. Morning. Yeah. Good morning. Love this organization. And you're here to talk about your big annual fundraiser. That's right. Which is one of the funnest fundraisers you can go to. I, I agree. Because you just eat yourself silly. <laughs> you do. It's, it's all you can eat. It's an extravaganza. <laughs> I love it. All right, so it's this huge breakfast mm -hmm. thing. Uh, let's talk about it a little bit. What okay. goes on? Well, um, this year it is on July 12th. Um, it takes place from 8 o'clock in the morning to 11.30 in the morning. It's at Presbyterian Northside. And it's really, um, it's a breakfast bonanza. It's all you can eat. We have a huge breakfast buffet, um, pancake station, omelet station, uh, full waffle bar, fruit bar. Um, if you have kids, bring kids. Um, See, this is something mm -hmm. you, your husband and young son could get yes. into. Yes, oh, absolutely. <laughs> kids, grandkids, neighbors, children, bring them all. Um, bouncy house, face painting, balloon animals. Uh, we have some midway games and some prizes that we'll be giving. Not kidding around. No, <laughs> no we are goodness. serious. Serious fun here. And the food okay. is excellent. <laughs> serious fun. So, Amanda, are you in charge of making all this? I am. For for this event. Yep. Give we, us an idea of the proportion. How much breakfast do you serve? So we have a full buffet, and yes. on our buffet, since it's Mardi Gras, we have Cajun themes. We have Cajun frittatas. We have cheesy garlic grits. We have Ooh. sausage and peppers. We're going to have beignets, we're going to have omelet stations, we have a waffle bar, a fruit bar, and we also have a kid's pancake station so the little kids can get sprinkles and chocolate chips on their <laughs> pancakes. And wow. um, Starbucks is donating our coffee this year, so we'll have Starbucks coffee. Beautiful. And we have Sprouts and Arc Enterprises also donated a lot of things so that helps us out with, we get all our fresh produce from sprouts uh -huh. they're giving it all to us we're Wonderful. excited That's about that huge great so uh, basically you come by anytime during the event and eat yeah mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah you don't have to be there right at eight in the morning you right. can come by at 11 15 and we will still have food for you um we have a lot of guest chefs that are coming in to cook um at our omelet station so we have guests from around the, the, the city really? yeah mm -hmm. so we have um a couple from Outback are going to be coming out. We have um, Jimmy Daskalos will be there. Um, Frost Mortgage, who is one of our title sponsors, they're sure. going to be running the pancake station. So, um, you mean Greg F Frost is going to flip pancakes? Greg yeah. Frost and Greg Frost Jr. will both be out there flipping pancakes. <laughs> How so, about that? Yes. No, that's involvement. <laughs> yeah, there you go. I, <laughs> I love it. This is such a fun event. Uh, the significance for the organization is what? Um, all proceeds for this event go to support our program. We have a low-income meal program. Um, obviously, we serve meals to homebound uh, people around the city. And we have a low-income meal program, which serves um, people who make less than $900 a month. Um, we are able to provide them with a meal um, and a friendly face. We have volunteers that go and deliver our meals every day. So um, that helps support that program. For a lot of people, that's their only person-to-person -person contact during the day. Mm -hmm. It is, yeah. Over so half our clients say that our volunteer is the only person that they get to see every day. Mm -hmm. That's why it's so important. A, a healthy meal and some people-to-people. -people. Absolutely. That's what the meals That nourishment that you need to feed your soul, you know? You need to, to yeah. be around other people. And it, it, the volunteers who do this are amazing people, aren't they? Yes, we wouldn't be able to do it if it wasn't for our volunteers. We have a small staff of about 18 people, and we have 400 volunteers. Wow. So wow. that kind of tells you the scope of um, how important our volunteers are to what we do every day. Um, and we're always looking for volunteers. Always, always, always. Look, the uh, 13th annual breakfast egg extravaganza is Saturday, July 12th. It's only $15 for adults. 
and 17 day of if you walk up, it's still a deal. And seven bucks for kids, and uh, it supports Meals on Wheels. Well, it's the best deal going. It really is. <laughs> it really is. You can come spend a fun morning. Um, it's completely casual. You know, you can hop out of bed, throw some shoes on and some shorts on, and head on out. Uh, now, no it's under a big tent, right? It is so, under a big tent. So yeah. it's outside. Yeah, but you're we not do have, sitting in the sun. No, you're not sitting in the sun. We have it, it fully tented, and we even have some air conditioners Look at out that. there. To, that looks like so much fun. Yeah. It's, it's, a, it's a happening. All yeah. right. So get the guys. I'm going to bring the boys. Yeah, bring the boys. Turn uh, Andreas loose at the pancake station. Yeah, he <laughs> likes clown pancakes. There you go. They'll probably figure that out. <laughs> hey, you guys, this is great. Anytime Meals on Wheels needs help, just let us know here awesome. on the morning crew, will you? Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck making all the food. Oh, she's <laughs> sweating already. Amanda Vargas, who is chef at Meals on Wheels of Albuquerque, and Shauna Kessler, who is the executive director of a program worth supporting. There you go. Back with more Morning Brew in a second.